Pacific Wonderland! Hey guys, it sure is a scorcher today. Uh, it's like 92 degrees, but it feels kind of nice. Oh, excuse me, it's because there's like a breeze going on right now. Also, the trash man came and took the couch, so that's really awesome because now we don't look like we live in a garbage place. There used to be garbage like all along here. I need to trim these weeds too, but it looks way better now. And we have our umbrella. We moved it over there with our cafe table, but I think I'm going to mow the lawn. I only have like 10 minutes of my lunch left, so why not be productive and mow the lawn? It's all about time management, right? But let's see if I can do it. So I know we've probably already showed you this, but this is our lawn mower. It doesn't use any fuel, so it's super environmentally friendly, but it is a little harder. It's not too hard. You can't like let your lawn grow really long. Compares frolicking in the grass. Do you see them? Um, so you can't let your grass grow very long, but it still works really well. And I actually like it better than a gas powered one because I don't know, it's just, you get the satisfaction of mowing the lawn. I don't know, maybe I'm weird. I used to never mow our lawn in California when we lived in California, but now that we live here, I mow it. And I used to mow it when I was a kid when I lived in Idaho, but we had like a gas powered one. Also like a, our weed eater that you use to like trim the sides is electric. So I just plug in an, uh, an extension cord and it doesn't use any gas either. So we're going green over here. And I'm done. It literally takes me like five minutes to do this lawn because it's so small. But I still need to do the weed eater. But I don't want to do it right now because I don't want to get grass all over my clothes. So now it's back to work for me. Paris, what are you doing over there? You miss your little mattress that you used to play with? Hi guys! So I just got back from a long day of work and then a meeting and I'm finally home and it looks like Paris got a puppy dog box and he has been trying to open it. What's in there? It's like Christmas morning with a toddler. Just tries to open it as I'm trying to do it for him. Okay, what's in, okay, we're opening it. What's inside? Ooh. Okay, so it says it's May. The snow is melting, the flowers are jumping out of the soil and the trees are blooming. Winter is over and your pooch will be ready to spring around the park. <laughs> He's ready to spring. Paws. So it's geared towards May, basically. Doggy date in the sun. What's inside? Ooh, a fetch. Oh, Paris. Oh, he just opened it. And what'd you find? So this is, again, we get these every time. Bark worthies. It's a, like a chew. Really healthy, all natural treat for him. Oh, we've got these ones. These ones are new. They're just the thicker, more textured, probably better for his teeth or... Yep, he loves it. We got a ball. Tough ball squeak. Go get it. <laughs> Good boy, Paris. Oh, how cool is this? K10 plus supplements for your dog's water. Okay, so this K10 vitamin, I've never heard of this. This is really cool. Basically, it has up to 90%, 90% of the minerals and vitamins your dog needs, and you just put it in, in the water. How cool is that? So this one actually uh, would last me two times, this one packet, because on feeding directions for a small dog like him, I only use half of it. So this is enough for two times. I really like that. That's really cool. I've never heard of vitamins for dogs. That's really cool. Whoa! So this company is Red Barn. It's a all natural, healthy company. And this is a pig ear, Paris. Is it a real ear? It's a real ear. That's so weird. Pig ear. Have you ever had a pig ear before? No, he has not. So this other company, Loving Pets, is another all natural, 100% USA made. This one here is Bite size chicken treats. Paris wants to try one. He's got to test it out. See what he thinks. What do you think? Does it smell good? Oh, it smells good, all right. There you go. 
this is really awesome. This is called Wigsy, and this company, it's providing um, healthy treats, but it's grain-free. So this one doesn't have potatoes, it doesn't have corn. Um, let's see what it does have in it. Dry cheddar cheese, pea flour, tapioca flour, and baking flour. Huh, that's really cool. This is the Wisconsin cheddar. It's like little cheese, it's for dogs. This is from the company Pet Sport. This is really cool. It's so that you don't have to touch the slimy ball. I mean, Paris doesn't really get the tennis ball slimy, but I can see how that would be handy. It also floats and it's great for tug of war as well. So it's kind of like a multi toy in one. Pretty cool. Tough ball, squeak ball is actually by the same company Pet Sport and it's supposed to be an extra strong, long lasting toy. And he likes it. So that was all that was in Paris's happy dog box for this month. And if you have a cute little dog or a big dog or any size dog, you can get your own pet box. There's a link in the description below. And if you go through that link and sign up for a box, you'll actually get your first box 50% off. I love this company. It's so fun opening it. Uh, Paris loves it. He thinks it is Christmas morning every month because he gets all of these treats and always at least one fun toy. And it's all really good healthy stuff for your dog that, stuff that is just really good for them. So yeah. All right guys, <clears throat> it is now dark and late and Kelsey is watching a show with her wine. Look at her on the couch. Relax time. Um, so we're gonna end the vlog. Thumbs up for the happy dog box because Paris loves it. Look at his ear, Paris. No, don't put that on our bed. That is weird. It's a full pig ear, Paris. He says, yeah, it's good too. All right, so thumbs up for the happy dog box and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already because we do new videos every single day and we will see you tomorrow. Ciao for now. Oh, oh. Ta da! Yeah. <laughs> now that's a three for one deal. <laughs>